I had already saved, but okay. Okay. Oh. So it's almost that time where I do a traditional end game grind here. Um, okay, let's uh, try to fly and see uh, if we're even able to leave. Level 14. I feel like we're supposed to like... I thought we were supposed to go to Midgar again, but maybe not yet. Sephiroth's energy barrier is gone. Sid, can the airship get inside? Huh? He's my pilot, ain't he? Of course he can go, uh, he can go anywhere. Right, sorry about that. Yo, Kate Sith, now what? <laughs> Hold it. Scarlet, Hidiger, what's going on? Strange. I can't reach the president. Not the president. To the sister ray. What is it, Reeve? You're speaking strangely. None of that matters. The, uh, the reactor's output is increasing all by itself. Wait a minute, that's not wise. It must cool for three hours or it won't work. Reeve, shut off the machine. We can't do that, it's inoperable. Someone has switched the machine over to mainframe operation. We can't operate it from here. What about the mainframe? Who? Hey, call the mainframe. Huh? Why are you giving the orders? I don't care how you do it. Oh, it's Hojo! Hojo! Just you wait, Sephiroth. I'll give you all the make you want. Hojo, stop the cannon. No, Midgar himself is in danger. One or two Midgars. It's a small price to pay. Hojo! Hojo! He's pretty much overloading the cannons. Show me Sephiroth. It should be near. Go beyond the powers of science. Before your presence. Science is powerless. I don't like it. But I'll comply. Just let me see it. See what? The reunion, I guess? This is what he's been waiting for all his career since making all this fail Sephiroth clones. Yo, do something, you big cat. <laughs> it's like waddling. We're sunk. Hojo's doing this on his own. Huh? I don't like this. You're busted, Reeve. Oh. Too late trying to hide it now. Can't you stop the Mako reactor? So all this time Reeve was the guy controlling Kate Sith. We can't stop it. You're from Shindra, aren't ya? So why is it impossible? We came a long way to get here. You better not double cross us now. I can't make you trust me. You damn fool. Don't you understand anything I'm saying? I don't give a damn about Shindra. If you're a man, no, if you're a human being, you'll save the planet. Don't you even care? No way. If we shut down the reactor, all hell will break loose. Why? Can't you just shut off the valve? Yeah, it's easy to shut off valve or shut off the reactor's pipe valves, but the reactor made a path for the energy to escape from below. Once you open that, it's impossible to close it until everything blasts out, and we can't try to stop the energy from gushing out. An explosion? That blast is way stronger than the section one reactor blew up. Damn. Forget that. The cannon. We've got to get to Midgar. That's the first thing. Must stop Hojo, or must stop Hojo first. So pretty much. Oh, it looks like Cloud and the others are on their way. Stay out of the way. Don't be foolish. I don't remember anyone putting you in charge. But yeah, Reeve, like we said, is controlling Kate Sith all this time. 
The Peace Preservation Force will do the best to defeat the enemy. Because of them, I... I... That's a private matter. Wait, what? The president is dead. Now I'm doing things my way. Oh, jeez. All hell is breaking loose. It's that power vacuum right here. Most part is Scarlet's not doing anything. Hediger, now I'm going to use the new weapon. Mm. Oh, no! Double, double cross. Hey, wait! Cloud, everybody! Sorry. But... Oh, I thought he was going to do something. But... But you'll come, won't you? I know. Hey, I'm leaving the ship in your hands. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm heading for Midgar. Or Midgar. Alright. Back to Midgar. Oh, what's this place? I don't think I've been here yet. Chocobo. It's unusual for you to come out of such an out of way place. I can't remember how long it's been since my last guest. Who are you? I'm. I don't know. <laughs> you don't know who you are. It's been a while since I gave it any thought. What was it they used to call me? Oh, yeah, they used to call me the Chocobo Sage. That's right. Right, that was it. The Chocobo Sage. No one will forget that. <laughs> Now, what can I do for you? Sell me something? I got greens, yep. Greens and nuts. Alright, so this if I wanted to do the, uh... Gold Chuck Bowl side quest, I would, like... Ooh. Another enemy skill material. Why so many? Anyways, yeah, you would go there for all the special nuts and whatnot. For, uh breeding chocobos, but I'm not going to do that this playthrough, so let's just go ahead and airdrop in, guys! We've reached Midgar. Even if we get there, uh, Midgar's under martial law. There'll be no way we can slip into the slums. Looks like all transportation from the slums is cut off. Hey, hey, what'd you think we have Highwind for? Where are we now? Huh? Where are we? If land's no go, we'll go by air! Yahoo! Okay, then we'll parachute into Midgar. Because the real question is, how is Reeves really controlling Kate Sith? Because it's not like he has a controller or something, right? I don't know. Alright, looks like we're sky jumping off. And this must be a uh, influence <laughs> for uh, Final Fantasy X when they all uh, rushed Bavel. Choose from the members below. Wait, I should have the same, right? Yeah, let's just keep them. Yes. Alright, guys. Here we go! Shahoo! Oh, Sid actually has a parachute. He's smart. Oh, they all have parachutes and stuff. Wait. Did Cloud have one? I'm confused. Yeah. yeah. It's really funny when they don't, uh. Hmm. What's it? Draw them all the way as, like, regular humans or whatever. They're, like, all these, uh, chibi <laughs> versions of themselves right now. Alright. Back in the game. Oh, so. Cloud did have a parachute. Hedger is going after you all. That's why it's dangerous out here. Let's go underground. Oh wow, we have this little backpack. I wonder if we could change uh, members here. Yeah, we can. Maybe I should just have some uh, change of uh, peoples. Probably keep Sid though, only because. Uh, what? What? Yeah, 
Let's keep Sid. Let's change Yuffie out. Again, I'm keeping Sid because he has triple on his, uh... uh can't think right now. Oh, this always hits. Why not? Hmm. <laughs> Cold attacks. Oh, if that's the case. Let's get some death blow. Because God Hand always hits, right? So why not have it so, uh... Why not have it so we always, uh, do crits? Wait, which one's better? Oh, Bahamut Zero is better than Neo Bahamut. But Neo Bahamut's about to level up. Uh... Oh, let's change Sid's to High Wind, too. Hoja who stirred up all this commotion after all these years. This place smells gross. Let's get it over with. It may sound strange coming from me, but it feels good being back in Midgar. Kind of makes me sick. I have an old score to settle with Hojo, so let's go. Alright, this is where we go in. Please, hurry to the Mako Cannon. Can I jump over there? Yes, I can. Oh, I can't! I got hustled, man. Now I can't get that item uh, on the other ladder over there. Unless. Oh, don't tell me I have to like, climb all the way back down again. Dang it. It's a behemoth! So why do you have this in your lab? A oh, D-Blow. Actually, I don't think I can climb this ladder at this moment. Tank from the back! I wonder why I haven't been uh, critting. Or not critting, but counterattacking. I should. Yeah, I do. Yeah. So 
hopefully I can still get that treasure. I'm confused. I just crit myself. Damn. That's probably she didn't kill herself. Maybe I should give a uh, Sid. Wrist. Well, we let's say. Uh, uh, uh. It's Oscar the Grouch. At least his cousin, maybe. Oh, sh okay. <laughs> He's very weak, though. I feel like I shouldn't save. But, oh well. We missed so many things. Oh, yeah, it should be what I think it is. Uh. Because I know it's about to happen. Oh, it's buried out of nowhere. <laughs> Doesn't feel fake Barret, but no, it's I just got a random encounter. It just goes to show I'm a little over leveled for this area. Yes, turbo ethers. Leave this to me. Hurry to the cannon. It's like uh, something I need to find, I believe. I believe all the way down this way is a special item we need. Other than that, or otherwise, I'm going the wrong way. Meaning, I'm going the right way. See in a second. So it's supposed to be you go all the way one direction and you're supposed to get the W item, I believe. We'll see in a second if I'm going the right way or not. So I think we're going like back through all the sections. Shadow Maker. Oh, slow. More slow. Oh, 
even more slow. chance I'm going the wrong way from what I really want. Oh, it's red 13. I smell it. The can is not this way. That's fine. Because <laughs> that means there's treasure this way. It's just a big uh, front kick. We got farming turbo ethers. This thing is going to be all the sources. Save spot. I think that's also W item right here. Okay, yeah. Not slow. Attack though. <laughs> there it is, the fabled W item. Let's go ahead and equip it. Uh, who should have it? Give it a cloud. Why is there a safe place if it is a dead end? I guess that's alright. I'm just gonna walk all the way back. Yay, terrible ethers. I'm trying to think, like, it takes this long to get W item. I wonder if, or how, we can get W item earlier. Hmm. So I feel like in the, 
Well, I'm trying to think. In the speed run, uh, I think they're able to get the uh, W item earlier, but I'm not 100% sure. Let me. Look up how to do W item glitch on the uh, sources. duplicate sources right now. That's a lot of gill I'm getting though. So apparently I can't do it with sources unless I morph or... Yeah, it looks like I can't do it with... Uh... So I can't uh, duplicate the sources the way I'm thinking. So it's not about pressing as fast as you can, it's about having, say, an enemy steal or something like that, and the item appears in your inventory, but then you like do something really quick, I don't know. Uh, I would have to research it if I really want to try it. So I can, like, duplicate everything else, but I can't uh, duplicate sources that simply. So maybe I'll just forego it. It's not that big of a deal, because pretty much you want to do it if you're speedrunning and you need to, like, boost your character's level or, like, attributes. But I can't, so...
<laughs> See, it just looks funny, like, twirling. Like that. Oh no, they're here! Uh oh. I should have saved again. This should be okay though. I am again over level for this part. What are we going to do? I think we can ignore our orders now. I feel like uh, Reno's hair is not uh, red enough. Elena, don't act so weak. We're Turks, Elena. Yes, sir. You're right. It's gonna be a, a blast, like, fighting through them in the remake. Come on, we've got work to do. I'm not really up for it, but our orders were to seek you out and kill. Our company may be in turmoil, but our order, but order is in order. That's the spirit of the Turks. Believe it. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Rude. Fist pumping. Where do you go? What are you doing? Let's go! Okay, let's end this. I know we have a re weird relationship, but we have to end this like Turks. I forget if uh, you can just say no. Oh, why are we uh, back attacking him? So you see how the elixirs are slowly racking up? I'm not quite sure exactly why this is happening, but I guess it's because you're canceling and it thinks you're canceling the first item that you, uh... That you were trying to, uh, duplicate. Let's see. Yeah. But the thing is, if you do it too fast, you might accidentally actually use it. Honestly, I feel like you don't really need to do this for like turbo ethers, but eh. Yeah, I think I have an idea on how we're supposed to duplicate sources, but I don't think I have the patience to do it right now. Maybe ever. Yeah, I can do these elixirs. I'll probably do the turbo ethers for fun. Probably do all the phoenix downs. Interestingly enough, you have to do the same uh, item twice, or whatever other item um, you want it to do, I guess. You would pick first, and then the second item doesn't matter, I don't think. Let's see? Yeah, it doesn't matter. Let's see, I'm here on Ether, but as you see, Turbo Ether is increasing. I 
I do for the Mega Elixirs too, might as well. It's probably like not the right place to be doing this. do as fast as possible but it's very scary if you do it too fast because you might accidentally duplicate the wrong one or not duplicate the wrong one but actually use the item you're trying to use or fake trying to use I should say I'll just duplicate Phoenix Downs to like 50 or something. I don't need full Phoenix Downs. I didn't even really need full everything else, but... Hmm, so yeah, if you didn't know about this glitch, uh, it's a good time to know about it now. I see Elena switched to back row actually, and then the other guys switched to front row. Oh, <laughs> I told myself I wasn't going to do 99, but I kind of just got carried away here. I honestly should probably do it for the remedies too. Oh, never mind. I don't need to. Uh, let's go ahead and regain everybody. Let's haste Tifa so she can use all the ultimas. Or maybe I should do wall first. Let's do wall first. Oh no! <laughs> Lucky! I got scared there for a second. Yeah, after this Tifa is just gonna use uh, Ultima until we're done. Haha! -ha. I think this time we actually have to beat everybody. Because mm, before we just uh, beat one of them and then they all ran away. But yeah, this time I think we have to kill them all. Kill them all! Yep. Oh, he's not dead yet, actually. Good end the spark. Oh, he has a little break. The question is, should I just use it? I feel like I should use it on Reno. Oh, slices of all opponents. Let's do it then. I thought it was just uh, one opponent, but... Hmm, he's just going to go around slashing everybody. Oh, that's it. Uh, I guess we only have to be defeat one of them. <laughs> Bye, Elena. That sucks. <laughs> I was gonna omni slash them to hell. Oh well, that's fine. <laughs> wow. Let's just use the mega elixir. Actually, go hit the save. I guess it's a good thing I went down instead of up. Because I would have had to face them first. I guess the real question is, am I even allowed to go back and get these other items that I missed? I feel like I'm able to. Hmm. 
but at the same time, I feel like they're gonna take me elsewhere. Uh, let's explore a little bit. Like, damn it. Uh, I know these items don't really matter, but the completion is in me. I just gotta get it. Just need it. I wonder if I can climb down this ladder, it'll take me up to where I need to go. Oh, dang it. Do it again. for a counterattack. Yeah, I think this ladder actually takes me to where I need to... Yeah, I can go to that uh, pipe right there. And hopefully I can get out all the other items that I missed. Ray. I don't know if that's for uh who's face, Barrett. Is there a way to get back? Back over to the other ledge? Ah, oh, dang it. Kind of screwed then. I really feel like the other items don't really matter. And even so, I don't even know how to get there, even if I wanted them. As long as I have the W item, I should be okay. Dang it. <laughs> I just can't not get it, or like, at least try to find a way to get it. I feel like I'm just screwed. I can't get all the other items. Yeah. I'm not even gonna try. I don't want to waste any more time. Because there's still some more grinding to do after. Oh, 
counterattack. Can't counterattack my counterattack. Any more time here? Oh, it's Yuffie. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Oh, which one am I supposed to go? She's not gonna tell me. I'm assuming to the right is the correct way. But she's standing there telling us to come on. This way. <laughs> oh, Yuffie's gone. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Always. I'm not like I screwed myself. Get back down. Back down. Back down. Well if there's like multiple ways to get to Shinra headquarters. I'm about, <laughs> now I'm about to uh, go back to that other place where I went outside. going outside. I must say that those water effects right there is pretty uh pretty snazzy <laughs> for uh how old this game is. Is this the wrong way? Is this the right way? I don't know. It is the right wrong way. This can't be. Hey, hey, you serious? Here's the Proud Club. 
It's the new weapon uh, Scarlet was talking about. Where's the Hedigur? I'm sure Scarlet's the one that's supposed to be. Nope, Hedigur. So they really showed up. Oh, they're both in there. <laughs> they're both laughing like idiots. You should treat us like dogs till now. You killed many of my precious soldiers. But let's see how you do against anti-weapon artillery. You guys are worthless, but my proud creation is great. Let's see how this goes. I'll show you the destructive power of the Proud Claude. I'm about to uh, go back and uh, <laughs> go the other way again. Jeez. So I don't know if it's... I don't want to attack the jammer armor, actually. Attack. You're finished. Well, maybe not finished, but nice, 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 nice. Wait, oh, yeah, they all count as crits. I forgot about that part. And below. Looks like the jammer is broken. As expected. I have a small feeling that. Uh, I have a small feeling that um, Sid can't reach. But let's uh, try. Oh, you can. E bend or blend. That sounds so diabolical. That kind of has a physical attack. I can steal anything from it. Nothing to steal. Everything to just kill it. Actually, let me do something. Oh, I think it's about to, uh, yep. Do something. Actually, let's duplicate these while I'm here. Cloud, wait, use it on himself? I don't understand. I don't understand. This is a weird. Let's try it again. Cloud. I'll probably use it on Tifa too. I think I can definitely use it on. Oh, it's because he has ribbon on. I forgot. I forgot. Beam cannon! <laughs> it does no damage. But I got overdrive. Alright, let's use this high wind. Oh, miss. Oh, yeah, because he has. Oh, wow, Fury, like, reduces her 100% chance of hitting. That's crazy. Oh, look at all that damage. Oh, he's dead. Oh, he's not dead. That didn't do as much damage as I was hoping. Let's go to round two. Uh oh. Pacow. Oh, he's dead. Oh, yeah. Time was born. <laughs> I like that. Everything is born. Ragnarok! 
Yes. No way. This is the Proud Claude? Oh. Why did it turn pastel pink? Whoa. I definitely forgot that I was wearing the, uh... Oh, mouse. Ragnarok's a uh, better version of the Crystal or Heaven's Cloud. Nice, nice. Yeah, it's pretty crazy that, uh... You know, God's Hand says attack percentage is 100, but... Uh, because she has Fury on, it actually somewhat negates that. Alright, so let me actually go the other way, because I'm like, I thought going the other way was where I needed to go, so I'm like, I don't want to skip anything, so. Right, let's go ahead and go this way then. Oh, look at that sword, that Ragnarok. Ragnarok and roll. I really hate this enemy. I guess it's in the off chance that you forget something back here, you would come here. And the thing is, we kind of did forget something here. At least it wasn't available to us the first time we were here, but I believe since we are back now, we should be able to... No, no, the sister way is not that way. No, but I need to go get something. So now since everything's kind of evacuated, I think we should be able to get these items in here. Because that lady at the counter is not here to master fist stop us from getting what we want. Pile bunker. Pretty sure this is master fist. It's not as strong as the god's hand though. Wait, what's the difference? Power up when condition changes. What? What does that mean? I feel like just wearing it just to find out what that means. Oh, the pile bunker is for uh, Barrett, I believe. And he's not in my party right now, so let's not worry about that. What does it mean when the conditions change? So now I can uh, de-blow every time. Let's go ahead and save though.
Ba -ba -ba -ba. I really hate this thing. It attacks so slow, and then it gives me slow on top of that. He did it twice. So she's still doing pretty good damage. I wonder if it's because she has Fury on. I wish there was a way to like increase limit break when dealing damage instead of taking damage. I don't know. I'm not sure what the specialty behind this is. This worker's glove or whatever it was. No, it's not worker's glove. What's it called? Master Fister? Master Fist? <laughs> I don't know. Let's just leave it out of God's hands. Good at dodging, I think. Yeah, I think that's too good. Uh, preemptive. Wait, oh, yeah, something was born actually. I should probably uh, take it off. Let's see. I guess we can do some more time. I guess I can do gravity some more. as well. Add a cut. Just give me some luck. I was debating whether or not to use a Mega Elixir, but I'm like, why? Why would I do that? Uh, I should really make uh, Cloud get Fury.
Oh, it's Kate Sith. He's up there. Oh, it's a shredder tank or something like that. Oh. What's going on? Everything. Nice. Ooh, all was born. Eight inch cannon. <laughs> so we busted up only to take the eight inch cannon off. All right, this I can double up on. Meaning, try to get as many alls as possible leveled up. Alright, right, let's get up this ladder. Oh, it's not even a ladder, it's a freaking stairwell. This way, Cloud! I'm coming. I'll be coming around the mountain when I come. Oh, another one of these. I wonder, if I, just, I wonder if I have to attack everything. So I think I should probably take off a uh, Fury, but maybe not. Nice. Maybe not. Restore was born. Mm, I guess I can keep that restore on, unless there's a lower level restore that's not mastered. Nope, we're all mastered. Oh, Vincent. Damn, Hojo. I think we're just gonna run up in there and just army slash him. Alright, all right, Hojo. Your time has come. I love how we have to walk all the way up to him. Only to run back a little bit. Hojo, stop right there! Oh, the failure. At least remember my name. It's Cloud. Every time I see you, it pains me that I had so little scientific sense. I saw you as a failed project, but you're the only one that succeeded as a Sephiroth clone. <sighs> I'm even beginning to hate myself. None of that matters. Just stop this nonsense. Nonsense? Oh, this? Ha ha ha. Sephiroth seems to be counting on this energy. So I'm going to lend him a hand. Why? Why do that? Quit asking me why, you moron. Hmm. Actually, you might make a good scientist. Energy level is at 83%. It's taking too long. Uh, my son needs power and help. That's the only reason. Your son? But he doesn't know it. What will Sephiroth think when he finds out I'm his father? He always looks down on me. Ooh. So he's the one who, uh, knocked up Lucretia. Oh, if only Vincent was here. Sephiroth is your son? I offered the woman with my child to Professor Gas Genova project. When Safroff was still in her womb, we took Genova cells. <laughs> I can't believe you're the one who did this. Illusionary crime against Sephiroth. No, you're wrong. 
It's my desire as a scientist. I was defeated by my drive to become a scientist. I lost last time too. I've injected genome cells into my own body. Oh jeez. Here are the results. I always thought Professor Gas was the one that uh, impregnated Lucretia. Either way, it's all messed up. And before I just straight up uh, overdrive him. Caps. Oh. I was about to just straight up limit break him, but I believe he has a second form. So I'm gonna wait for a second form. Yeah, he's a big ass forehead, I would say that. Ouch. <laughs> Going upstairs, guys. those things, uh, the other creations have, uh, what should we call it, 99, 9, life. No, that's not strong at all. It will not do. Fire too. Oh, miss, nice. Oh, that, uh, missile. There's just wait. Oh, now let's see how the maple juice is reacting. So, yep, yeah, as I said, he has two forms, and here's the second one. Uh, that is nasty. Mm, but prepare thyself. You shall be Omni Slash before this is over. Slices up all opponents. Oh, I'm out of uh, MP. Wow, <laughs> his animation is like a summon. That's pretty cool. I forget how many hits this is. 14, right? And a brave attendant! And he's... Is he dead? He's not letting me do anything. I think he's dead. Oh no, there's a final form. A final final. I forgot about this part. I wasted it. That's okay. There we go. I forgot they had a final final form. That's okay. Ah, that was very weak. Alright, I'm just gonna beat this guy down. Combo. <laughs> he missed the combo. Oh, sleep. I just realized that I don't have um, a Suna with anybody. I wonder how that, uh. Oh, I have ribbon on. 
Bogosh. But I wonder how um, the relationship between poison and regen works. I think poison you take damage periodically, right? Aha! Ah! Well, Tifa has a limit break. Wake her up! Oh, never mind. He is dead. And I'm still healing. Look at that. Gotta love that regen. Watch those levels increase. Nice. Look at that power source. Hojo's dead for sure. Should have killed him last time. Now I think about it, we didn't even fight him last time. He just sucked his, uh, or sicked his experiment on us. <laughs> I can't believe Sephiroth is Hojo's son. I can't believe a lot of things about that statement. Well, Hojo dead, nah. Shindra's finished. Meteor's gonna fall in about seven more days. That's what my grandfather said. Red 13. You want to see everyone in Cosmo Canyon again? Yes. You want to see Marlene, right? Don't ask me that. We'll beat Sephiroth. Then, if we don't release the power of Holy in seven days, there won't be a planet left to protect. If we can't beat Sephiroth, it's as good as death for us. We'll just go a few days sooner than the rest who will die from Meteor. Don't think you're gonna lose before you fight. No. What I meant was, what are we all fighting for? I want us all to understand that. Save the planet for the future of the planet? Sure, that's all fine. But really, is that how it is? For me, this is a personal feud. I want to beat Sephiroth and settle my past. Saving the planet just happens to be part of that. I've been thinking. I think we all are fighting for ourselves, for ourselves, and that someone, something, whatever it is, that's important to us. That's what we're fighting for. That's why we keep up this battle for the planet. You're right. It sounds cool saying it's to save the planet, but I was the one who blew up that Mako reactor. Looking back at it now, I can see that wasn't the right way to do things. I made a lot of friends and innocent bystanders suffer. At first, it was revenge against Shinra for attacking my town. But now, yeah, I'm fighting for Mar Marlene. For Marlene? For Marlene's future? Yeah, I guess I want to save the planet for Marlene's sake. Go and see her. Make sure you're right and come back. All of you, get off the ship and find out your reasons for yourselves. I want you to make sure that I want you to come back. Maybe ain't none of us so come back. Mir's gonna kill us anyway. <laughs> Let's just forget any useless struggling. I know why I'm fighting. I'm fighting to save the planet, and that's that. But besides that, there's something personal too. A very personal memory that I have. What about you all? I want all of you to find that something within yourselves. If you don't find it, then that's okay too. You can't fight without a reason, right? So I won't hold it against you if you don't come back. Tifa's like still not <laughs> looking at us or whatever but she's still here what are you doing or what are you going to do Tifa did you forget I'm all alone I don't have anywhere to go poor Tifa everyone's gone yeah we don't have anywhere or anyone to go home to you're right But I'm sure one day, they'll come back, don't you think? Hmm, I wonder. We only have seven days. 
Everyone has something irreplaceable they're holding on to. But this time, our opponent. Hmm. But that's alright. If no one comes back, as long as we're together, with you by my side, I'll never give up no matter how bad it gets. Tifa. No matter how close we are now, we were far apart before. But when we were in the live stream, surrounded by all those screams of anguish, I thought I heard your voice. Sniff, you probably don't remember this, but deep in my heart, I heard you calling my name. Or at least I thought you did. <laughs> I see. I think I've heard it too. Then it was Tifa's voice. Cloud, do you think the stars can hear us? Do you think they see how hard we're fighting for them? Stars? I don't know, but whether they can or not, we still have to do what we can and believe in ourselves. I'll find the answer someday, as long as I keep trying. Yes, that's right. We've got a big battle tomorrow. We better get some sleep. Hmm... I guess you're right. Oh. It's almost on. Uh huh? Morning, Tifa. It's almost on. Hmm. Good morning, Cloud. Just a little longer. Just a little bit longer. This day will never come again, so let me have this moment. Yep, <clears throat> for sure this is the uh, official couple of Final Fantasy set. Cloud and Tifa. I don't think they actually get together, right? Because even in Advent Children... No, I don't think they did. Anywho. I stand them very hard. <laughs> What's up, Amethyst? How's it going? But no, they don't get together. Yeah. And they're just friends to the end, I guess. We better go. Cooking now? Nice. But I still... It'll be alright, Tifa. You said so yourself yesterday. At least we don't have to go on alone. So we have each other. Just got done streaming Modern Warfare 2. Nice. How far did you get? Yes, that's right. Okay, let's go. This airship is too big for just the two of us. Pretty much at the end of Act 2. <laughs> so I'm trying to think when act, where Act 2 ended. After Nuke goes off. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. <clears throat> Wait. Oh yeah, Nuke does go off in the second one. Wait. Oh, the from the flashback, right? Don't worry, you'll be okay. I'll make a big enough ruckus for everyone. Besides, I'm the pli I'm the pilot. No more flying around casually like before. You won't have time to feel lonely. There's two nukes. The first and the second. Oh yeah. I think we have to fight Oh, I mean Sid's here. <laughs> flashback in third. That's when Yuri had the flashback. Everyone's here. Whole gang's back. Barrett, sit. Oh, oh, is that okay with you? <laughs> Red 13. Why didn't you tell me? But, you know, Sid. Hey, Red 13, if you butt in now, you never know what they'll say later. 
Were you listening? <laughs> Vincent, he's back too. Why such a puzzled look? Don't you want me to come? No, it's just you're always so cool to what is happening. I thought you didn't care. Cool. <laughs> I just, just I guess that's just how I am. I'm sorry. <laughs> he just backflips into his corner. Or whatever. Oh, well, looky here. The Shindra managers come back. Yeah, Reeves. Yeah, this whole time Reeves was the guy controlling Kate Sith. Uh, excuse me, but I wanted to come with the main group, but I couldn't get away. So, some people in Midgard took me in. I know I have a stuffed animal body, but I'll work really hard. Guess that's everyone. No, Yuffie's missing. She ain't gonna show up. At least this time she didn't steal our materia. Thank God for that. <laughs> so you talking about me? How could you say that? After I came this far with you? Even with my air sickness? I didn't go through all that just to have you guys have the best parts all to yourselves. Welcome back, Yuffie. Gee, Cloud, that's so nice of you to say that. You sick or something? Well, whatever. I'm going to be in my reserve seat in the hall. Waiting up for a couple of days. <laughs> Demon ass, Yuffie. Yeah. She's so silly. But all right. Thanks, everyone. We didn't come back for your spiky-headed ass. I came for Mar <laughs> came back for Marlene. Guess it's just my feelings or something. I uh, I ain't got no words now. Oh, there's Iris. Although she's not here, she left us a window of opportunity. We can't let it go like this. Iris, she was smiling till the end. We can't just let it end with that smile. We have to do something. Let's all go together. Memories of Eris. Although she should have returned to the planet by now. Something stopped her and now she's stuck. We've got to let go of Eris' memory. Has anyone here changed their mind? I'm counting on you, Sid. Yeah, yeah. These two lovers have been bugging me for a while. Let me try them out. Alright, so what should I do? You decide, Cloud. This is our last battle. Our target is North Cave. Our enemy, Sephiroth. So let's move out. The Rusters the Maximum. Yeah. Oh, it looks like all the pilots went home, actually. We're almost in the North Cave. We're on our way, Sephiroth. Man, I'm gonna stick it to him. <laughs> right in the ass. What is it, Sid? There's some incredible force. Losing control. Oh, yeah, it's Ultima Weapon. Oh, what are you guys doing? <laughs> Get the hell out of here, Flunkies. Yeah, I tell you all to go home. Yes, sir, but this is our home. Oh, my. Stop trying to act so cool. Alright, you jokers. Hold me down with everything you got. Wait, why are we holding Sid down? Geronimo. Yeah, I thought we were supposed to fight a, a mega weapon, apparently, in the sky. Or is it ultimate weapon? I always get the two mixed up. End of part two.